Hello, hello everybody, we are continuing our adventures here in Mass Effect 3. I'm going to quickly go do a roundabout on the ship in case there's anything that I'm unaware of that my secretary has not told me of anything. And uh, then I guess we'll uh, probably do that uh, energy reactor thingy, uh, the N7 hey, mission. Because priority things. missions scare me sometimes. Like some sort of cockroach wasp thing. So you went into the Geth consensus? Yeah. Like virtual reality. Kind of like that. Yeah. It was strange, but I got out all right. Did you? I mean, how would you know? <laughs> how would I know what? If you really got out. See, if the Geth experience everything virtually, then you could only think you're in the real world. Not really. Like this, like everything you're seeing now, is a simulation. I mean, technically, it is a simulation because it is a video game. Does that make Commander Shepard a Geth? Am I his platform or is he mine? No one knows. Yeah, well, there were so slight times that they actually say things and compared to when they don't, it's just a little weird. Today we say things, tomorrow we don't. Hallelujah. I wonder if I should just buy, like, the various guns and stuff. Huh. Did not know that that was a thing. I can give that to my allies. Yeah, I wonder if I should just, like, try and buy things, but at the same time, I kind of wish that it, the game would tell you, like, how much of a stat was made to that stat because of upgrades and how much is the actual gun. Ammo capacity, but the helmet's ugly, so no. We're, but we're fashion soulsing, never so slightly. Let's see. Sure. I have the money. I have all the money. Nobody gets to tell me what's well. That's the scope. I don't care. Recharge, don't care. Melee damage, don't care. Inferno armor, it's an armor set, so I can't upgrade. Like, that'd be one thing if you could actually, like, I want to do this, and then the game lets you. As in, like, hey, I want to, like, buy this armor, but then I want to upgrade the armor and change the different pieces. And then the game is just like, no, you can't do that. Why? Because, well, we don't want you to. Pistol power magnifier 2. Still weird. High velocity barrel. Just so many things. Oh, <laughs> a Geth ship, and then just model ship. Oh, it's a oh model live ship that will be added to my shenanigans. Let's see. Hmm. There's way too many things to upgrade. So now I know why that one mod was kind of made, in a way. They're like, look at all of these. All of these upgrades that you can't really get. Because if you buy all the weapons, and then buy all the upgrades, like, you're going, okay, he's, he's out wandering. Oh, no. Are you below? Javik? Feasting upon the immaterial souls? I wonder who- I still want to know who let my space hamster out to wander the engine room. Not sure what to think about that little mech dog roaming the ship. He's a good boy. Sophie? I think she's cute. He's a good girl. What purpose does she serve? I guess <laughs> I have a soft spot for worthless dogs. Look how long I've been with you. Ha! And he took it on the chin. The reason we have it is because a soldier. Breaking now, a nightmare on Earth. Human 
leaders using military force on their own Yay, people. indoctrination. They say it's to prevent loose cannons from provoking the Reapers. But are they indoctrinated? Yes. The Resistance speaks out in the only place they can, the battle space. Does Dr. Tassoni ever let you in her room? Because she keeps me out. Huh, I wonder why. Oh, because battle space and she's the, the, the shadow broker. So if you went in there, you'd be like... Breaking. Shadow Broker is Dr. Tassone. Then again, I have editing privileges, so... You might not do that, but... So... Prothean, huh? Yes. <laughs> you guys like to drink? Booze it up? No. Okay. What about gambling? Play cards? No. Games of chance were punishable by death in the Empire. Lol. Oh, sure. Sure, that seems... Reasonable. Okay, so smoking, you ever do that? Only when my armor became inflamed. Lol. Right, yeah, smoking, I get it. So jokes then, you got jokes, all right. You got any good ones? No. No. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Give them to me. The Tulomorian spy entered the enemy's camp and said to the Vanksher, I didn't know your barnabs could glow. Um. <laughs> Lol. That was the joke. <laughs> <laughs> right. Poor James. I had hoped the Geth would have analyzed any Prothean technology they came across. Let's see. Geth schematics were downloaded from the consensus. They appear to be designed for brute resistant criminals and Geth platforms. That's Shield bad, strength or power damage? Thank you for Shields. Shield region or power cooldown? Shield region. Smuggler Manifest. Operative Morat has sent Smuggler Manifests of the Athabasca class freighter to authorities in the Yangi system. The manifest follows 8,000 tons of dextro amino food supplies, of lots of amino acids, well, different kind of food thingies. <laughs> 300 indentured workers, slaves from Carson recaptured, attempting to escape Reapers, mainly Batarian. Interesting. And kind of horrifying. But yes, now we shall head out. I think we will... We were going to try and scan. If there were, like, any places that... Because uh, I think there are, like, two places new that popped up that we can potentially scan. And then... So let's see. Because there's, yeah, the Argos Row. And then another one. To the left. And then we'll go do the mission. First things first, we're gonna fucking save because, again, the game is mean. The game is mean and it makes this part of the game kind of annoying. Because, like, I'm gonna scan. I found something. I'll do this, even though we're gonna reload, just to see how many things we need to be on the lookout for. What be this? Haptic Optics Array. 50%. Now we just need to run around like a madman. Aha! Found it. Evasion successful. Oh dear God. Alright, but now we know where both things are. The problem is, it's entirely possible that if I scan twice, the Reapers will come, because that's the kind of game this is. I found something. Yeah, from the looks of it, I will not be able to scan it and then do things. So, I'm just going to have to keep it in the back of my mind that it's down the kind of lower right maybe middle-ish and just need to be very careful we're going to head up to Phoenix Arizona don't know how we got up here in space far far away once again we better save save because fear Utter fear. Pinnacle Station.
Signal confirmed. Why is this place horrifying? I also kind of miss the hearing chatter when we scan anomalies. Victorian Spec Ops team. Oh boy, 33%. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, they're both here. Oh yeah, now I have to do the runabout. Evasion Depending on where I enter. I enter at the bad place because game is mean. Alright, but hey, they're close together. Still think the game will be like, oh, two, two scans? Even though there are three things? How dare. So I might be able to get them both and run. Fossilized Cacliosaur. Then we can grab this and recover a decent chunk, but we're never coming here again, so let's leave. Evasion successful. Hmm. I'm going to save over that now. And we're just going to make a straight beeline down here. See if we can make it. To Gorgon. Alright. Because it'll probably follow the same principles. I found something. Alright, that planet. Just wanna find spa station. Spa station. Reapers eluded. Unless it's literally just that planet. Would be an interesting choice if it's just this one planet. Then I'll, I'll look like the fool. Yeah, it is. Interesting. I am the fool. So we can just scan that and go. My god, the only semi-balanced place in I the galaxy something. for scanning against the Reapers. Except even then, not really, because... Beyond the natural inclination to be like, Oh, scan that one, closest planet. It is still entirely possible. Entirely possible that you'll miss it and waste your, like, one safe scan. Save, just in case I miss. And then we'll grab the fuel and head over to the other one. Maybe this is how they kind of plan things to go. Where you find where everything is, scan and run. Or sometimes they'll just be like, Oh yeah, the first one, that just opens it up completely. The other one, oh yeah, just out of nowhere, just nothing. I mean, the, the mechanics make no sense. They hurt my sense. Signal confirmed. Huzzah. And there's even a fuel thing, even though we can't go anywhere in this galaxy. Well, not galaxy, this is star system. Bop. Dr. Jaliz. We got one person. Alright, then we'll buy fuel because we're pretty rich and we don't have much, much to worry about. We're going to save once again and then we'll do this mission, check out the Citadel, drop off some things, and then we'll probably finish the horrifying war that we're dealing with. Because nothing's nice. Oh! And Tally can come with us on missions. For now. Huh. 
Why is it empty? Give me my Black Widow. Yeah, why is it empty? That's... weird. I didn't choose any of this. Why was it empty? I have eight points. I'm gonna be maxed out. Increase headshot damage to frozen enemies. Increase ammo capacity. Hell yeah. Garrus is three. Tally is five. Well, uh, I'm gonna save up and get you uh, finish all that. Finish your drones. Shepard, about 72 hours ago, the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Scans at the station are cold. It's deserted. What happened to the troop station there? Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. We're gonna blow up the reactors. Good. So we need to get okay, Riley back. Good, hack it out. We must save everyone. He watched us go. He's a sicko. Command, it's just nice to have the team back. Reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. Hopefully Captain Riley ha hasn't uh, gone evil. Alright, and now we'll save just to be safe. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. Been through thick and thicker. The captain always sees us through. Always sees you through, eh? Does that mean he might betray people? I forgot to check out my armor. I'm gonna have to check out those other ones, because... There's like a 50-50 chance for all of these, oh, go do a mission things, and then you can like pick something up to deliver back to the Citadel. And some of them are just in weird places. I don't want to miss them. Meet Riley. So if we... F ah, poison gas. A treatment plan for chemical burns. This is pretty detailed. All right, I'm going to assume that's the thing. Hey, soldier. Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting access to most of the grid. Survival in hotspots, not possible. We need a radiation workaround, soldier. On it, ma'am. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Joy. Roger that. The fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Are you the man? Understood, Lieutenant. Got it, Captain. Good work, Conwell. Oh. I'll take it from here. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll call you until you're clear. Interesting. Was it through the door? Spin power, but I don't want to. Team two, moving out, Commander. Good luck, Captain. There were a hundred Turian stationed here. Now, nothing. Oh, maybe. maybe. They, they wouldn't. Pretty maybe sure this? They're all dead. Nope. Just stay sharp, people. Oh, I need to activate the crane even more. <laughs> then we drop that. And go pick up the other one. Ha ha. My brain was too simple. My brain was just too simple. Same. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. This looks like ventilation control. 
Should do the trick. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. Let's unlock those fuel rods. Yeah, this place is way too big. More shit's gonna go down. Shoot the barrier engine. Back off. Don't put a thing that's hard to shoot. That's the whole point of this game. This is massive shoot. Riley, status. Dead. Like casualty, casualty, or like dead. And considering we already got one, seems to be like one hey, go, go do thing on Citadel, Bobby. I'm going to assume that there isn't another, but Riley, better safe than position? sorry. I'm going to assume there isn't another... Hey, pick up thing, go Citadel. Well, let's uh, restart the chaos. Oh, I got credits, but I didn't restart. Initiating restart. That's weird. Commander, Captain, I'm reading a lot of movement. Headed your way. From where? Incoming! Progress. Round two, here we go. They're coming in from above. No, they're not. They're coming in from, uh, well, technically below. But really, it's just frontal assault. That is diabolizing the husks for power. Oh, that's what you mean. So they begin from above. Get out of here. <laughs> he landed in a funny place. I'm sending help. Hold tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. Garrus, go. Garrus, I'm counting on you. On my way. You better not die to something this... Ah, oh, fuck. Why does he have to have a barrier? Never mind. You, you, I'm gonna punch you. Very rude. I don't even know what shattered my armor like that. Darn the barriers. You're clear for the moment, Commander. Can't raise Captain Riley. What about Garrus? Nothing, Commander. No one's answering my hail. But I'm tracking some movement toward the pickup point. Finalize the restart, then we can rendezvous there. Will do. Hmm, so I wasn't supposed to run through. That was, I guess, for Garrus to run through, and it just revealed a brute. Garrus had better not be dead. Yay. That would be a dumb way to die. Commander, you saved our asses. My team is in your debt. 
And you kept Garrus from dying, so good job. Job well done. Report back to the shuttles. Huzzah! Whenever I have to send somebody, I weary. Good work down there, Shepard. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? Probable. I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. I'll keep you posted on new developments. Hack it out. Woot, woot. And just as a side thing, I don't, it doesn't look like I'm at 100% reputation. Profound sadness. Do I have to save the universe for that to happen? That'd be kind of funny. I got so much. And just nice to have that Tally can be a companion during all this. All right, now we're gonna head to the Citadel, unless there's any other planetary places that want to evolve from the void. But probably not. And then I'll make a concerted effort not to go to Dr. Bryson's lab. And he's like, go to Dr. Bryson's lab, visit Anderson's apartment, start all these things, start all these things. I'm just like, no, no. Still no Hades Nexus, no idea why I can't do that. I know that that 83% is because I didn't pick up one fuel thingy. Which means I either missed something in the monastery. Okay, now be careful upon approach. Don't click apartment. Because that starts a series of events that cannot be stopped. Do you need ground transport? Take me to the embassies. I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. Why does it feel like my sensitivity has been drained? Well, let's check a sorry war strategist. So I can talk to her. Ah, tallies in Presidium Commons. Nothing in docks. Nothing in Purgatory. And nothing in Normandy Bay. Excuse me, I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. A Reaper code fragment. Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. Just don't get eaten by that data. Don't become a sorry Saren. Didn't I hear the end of that? Where, uh, she jumped through the 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 reception receptionist jumped through all the hoops, and fixed it for her. We still don't know what happened to Miranda. Commendation, Captain Riley. Captain Riley, an N7 operative, has been nominated for a condom, uh, commendation for a valor for actions on Scion. Approval. Vote fast track the rule. Do it. She deserves good. Especially because we're at war. Don't want her to die. Would be kind of funny if there are a few commendations or things in there that are better off not authorized. But at the same time, would be kind of a dick move unless it's like kind of obvious. All right, now we'll go to Huerta Memorial. And then Presidium Commons. And then we'll head back to the war effort, I guess. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. War and death. I wonder where the other doctor went. All right, so I think that one to the right. Nope. My camera bumped the monitor, so I thought I was being dragged into a, a thing against my will. Doctor Silo. This treatment plant at the chemical plant. Could it help? Treatment. What is? I've never seen this kind of process before. Huh. Probably experimental. It's a long shot, but let's run some tests and see if it might work for our patient. Huzzah! 
All right. Now, Presidium Commons, where we can talk to War Strategist, Seasick Officer, and Tally. Because I assume Tally won't be a permanent ally once we fix all the problems of the Geth Quarian War. I can't believe I did all the right things. I even did a, a renegade action that did a lot. And then the game was just like, oh, and then the Quarians did a dumb, forcing the Geth into, like, survival mode. Uh. Wrong diddly way. I needed to go to the 94. Actually, I found a Cacleosaurus skull preserved in amber. Maybe you could clone it, or... You're kidding? You're kidding. Seriously? <laughs> well, um, if, if the genetic material is intact, we could... Hmm. Well, we've got cloning facilities on Sarkesh. Cacleosaur genes were remarkably pliable. Cloning might be effective. Uh -huh. There you go, my dear sir. I do find it funny that running about giving things to people is one of the most effective ways. Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. Disarmed there safely. No so, casualties. wrong CSEC officer. I walked by him and was like, oh, that's a CSEC officer. Hello, my dear sir. I pulled this from a Geth jamming tower. Maybe you can use it. How the hell did you... <laughs> Like this, I don't care where it came from. That's all. I'll have my people run with this. When the war comes back here. Maybe we can save more lives. I did it. Now we go talk to Tally in the courtyard. It says she should be here. Maybe down below courtyard. Then again, that's probably this whole area's courtyard. What are you doing? You're just pointing? Look at that billboard. It's a nice billboard. There has to be some way for us to get more medical supplies. I told you already, we have nothing to spare. We're willing to pay. It's not about payment. Between the war on Palavan and the coup attempt here, supplies are short. Hmm. If my people don't get more antibiotics and metagel, thousands of us will die. Then maybe you picked a bad time to start a war. While he has a point, I support my girl. Tally saved the Citadel a couple of years ago. Watch your tone. You're right. <laughs> We're all on edge right now, but we don't have enough metagel for our own needs. We can't help your people right now. I'm sorry. Damn it. Thank you for trying to help. See, that's all you had to say. <laughs> Be less antagonistic and just say, I'm sorry, but we lack the resources to give you even if we had it. <laughs> well, no, not even that. It's just like, we would give it to you if we could, but the thing is, we just do not have it. I'll do one last check around on the map. Nobody. Commander Bailey, but he's always there. Jacob, but he's always there. Arya, ED, Joker, but they're always there. Liara, James, Eid. So, hey, good thing I came here. Got a little reputation boost. Gotta be careful. Don't want to check uh, Bryson's lab just yet. All right. Now we're going to fly off. And maybe destroy the Reaper Bay. So look over my journal one last time, but we'll probably go destroy the Reaper Base. Alright. Head to Rannoch. Check my journal. Because I think that's all that's really available to us beyond, like, oh, go here, scan planet. This looks like not much we can do. And also that, that's going to haunt me forever because I didn't find the goddamn couch. Don't have any Cerberus ciphers. Citadel, surely, if that's the go-to apartment. No, thank you. 
So, yeah, aside from Leviathan and Shore Leave, we just have go destroy the Reaper base. So, to the Reaper base we go! Hope I can gut punch Grell again and say, fuck off with your stupid war, make peace with the Geth. I saw what your people did all those years ago, you fanatical little bitch. You little bitch boy. Let's -a go. Fear. All right. Three, three, five. The sinking laser needs a line of sight. What's the fastest route? The upper entrance. Target the base before the Geth can organize resistance. Well, what about you? We will deactivate defense systems and acquire an escape vehicle. I thought Geth do don't that. have escape vehicles. This unit still carries remnants of the old machine upgrade code. We can break any Geth security. You are concerned. No, nah, it's okay. I trust you, Legion. You know your limits. I trust you. I'm more concerned. You're a good platform. About the upgrades. You were tolerant of our recovery of Geth intelligences from the server, but this matter is different. Personal. You were ashamed. Shame is an emotional or cognitive response to societal judgment. But you are evolving because of the Geth or the Reaper I'm upgrade. On your side here, Legion. I want to help your people. We did not intend to cause offense. How do we get here? The Geth are better than this. War from the Quarians, technically. No. Based on empirical evidence, they are not. Yeah. Proceed to the upper entrance. We will exit here and procure an escape vehicle. Again, Got Reapers, it. I mean, Legion. Geth, don't Good keep luck. escape vehicles. I forgot to check my armor again. Damn it. How's it feel being on Homeworld? I can't believe it. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. The Homeworld. My world. Look at the sky, and the rock formations. They used to write poems about them. And they will again. When we're done, maybe you'll write a new one. This is Ranok, the world of our ancestors. Our bodies carried the seeds that spread the desert grass. You've heard me say, Kilasalai. The best translation I can come up with is, by the home world I hope to see someday. Looks like you're seeing it today. The living room window will be right <laughs> here. Something I should know? I just claimed the land. I know it doesn't mean much. But when this is over, I'll have a home. The Quarians spent centuries as nomads. You think you can go back to living in one place? We have gotten used to carrying our homes around with us. Yeah, rock. <laughs> That's a start. Carry around home with you. Geth, surrender or die. Why do they have glass? I keep forgetting that I can just scroll wheel. Shut down. And again, luckily we're not really killing that many Geth because they upload their memories and stuff. Well, less, less that and more they, like, escape. They're like, this platform is dying. Goodbye. Jesus, there's a lot of these bastards. And the thing is, if I actually, I hope I don't have to choose between the Geth and the Quarians because the Quarians were in the wrong here. 
Legion literally said that if there wasn't a war, the Geth would have opposed the the Reapers, the old machines. But they feared for their goddamn lives. Well, less fear for their lives and more we're like, hey, uh, we don't want to be eradicated. I don't like it when Grell gives commands. Like every single time Grell gives a command now, I'm just going to expect death to rain down upon me. Damn it, he jumped. And he didn't even do a backflip. Show your ugly ass. Show your ugly ass. I don't need to see your ass to shoot you. My gun penetrates! I, I wonder how many times I've gotten Casa Fabrication thingies. Penetrate to Geth. But oh well. Okay, the game just wouldn't let me shoot there. Bullshit. Listen, if I'm scoped in, I get shoot. If I scope in, I get shoot. Eh, they're rockets. They destabilize you. Screw you. I don't believe in rockets. Rockets, I do not conform to your beliefs. The heretic rockets will not take me. Ah, they don't have reinforcements. I'm Commander Shepard. Damn it. I shot his elbow and he exploded. Because he had one hell of a funny bone. Damn. Did it take hours to put through that shield? We don't have that kind of time. We have located an override atop the F fortifications. It can retract the blast shield. Anyone get a good look at that thing? More guests dropping in. There's something about fighting Geth alongside Talion Garrus. Like the good old days. You know, back when a rogue Spectre and one Reaper was all we had to worry about. Bad cover. Watch out! Crossfire on the left side balcony. That balcony. Or that ah oh, that balcony. I call that a runway. Yes, yes, yes. You're so sneaky. You're so sneaky. You ducked under my goddamn sniper shot, you bastard. Ah, uh, but at least you blew up. So. You have a modicum of good. We'll get through. What's your status? The old machine's upgrades grant us targeting superiority. We are drawing hostile fire from your position. Don't die. You are a living Keep thing up. now. We'll get to the blast shield controls. Granted, you kind of always have been. On our side, but Reaper code? 
No, Legion's on our side. Yay! Never thought I'd hear you say that. Things can change. Survive my favorite breach mission. There's a flame boy. I love it when I can shoot through things because the game is nice and realizes, hey, we understand that you should be able to shoot right now, so we will let you. That's what I figured. gonna rapid shoot you. Grenade. How dare I be stunned, but not you be stunned. How come I'm the one that gets stun locked? up thing I hate that that's the one thing I hate you're up near a wall but yeah there's a thing on the barrier let me access barrier holdings gonna save because scared Why do I keep falling? That was a Reaper, wasn't it? like close lines the back of a gap. I knew that the Reaper thing was gonna be an actual Reaper. Oh boy, turret section. We will attempt evasive maneuvers. Ooh, Metal Gear Solid level uh Why does it have Wheatley armor? What the hell? What hit it? What took it down so easily? What did we hit? The firing 
chamber. Looks like a weak point when it's priming. Damn it. The charring towers have us targeting manually. We can't make a precision shot. We may escape before it recovers. No. Pull over. I'm gonna talk it to death. Or am I going to if we manually away, lock? Can't stand reaper control and the quarians are dead. This ends now. Edie, patch the quarians to the Normandy's weapon system. I want the targeting laser synced up to the whole damn fleet. Hell yeah. Understood. If this doesn't, if we don't make it, you worry too much. I love you. Love you too. Keep us alive. Shepard to fleet. I'll paint the weak spot. Wake up with the Normandy and be ready to fire. Giving it. Come closer, you son of a bitch. Oh, instant death, sadness. Ah, it saves. So I need to dodge when it's aiming. You have very bad aim. Honestly, that kid should be ashamed that it died to a Reaper on Earth. You're ugly. Him pointing an entire fleet at you. An entire fleet. Come on, that was Bowser damage. But you're definitely on your last legs. By now, I'm Commander Shepard. Are you serious? <laughs> it is just like I'm going to stare you to death. Hell yeah. I literally pointed it to death. Die, Reaper. Hell yeah. Kill the goddamn Reaper. I just need an entire fleet to kill one. Oh no, it's still there, technically. Hello, bastard. You know who I am? Harmonger speaks of you. You resist, but you will fail. The cycle must continue. Help us understand. What are you talking about? We stopped Sovereign and the Geth. We stopped Harbinger and the Collectors. We've earned a straight answer. It is not a thing you can comprehend. We really? might surprise you. You represent chaos. We represent 
Actually, have a point. You just have a philosophy that you yourself believe in nothing else. Without our intervention, organics are doomed. We are your salvation. I reject your reality. You're killing everyone in the galaxy to save us? The cycle must continue. There is no alternative. The alternative is I beat you. Organics and synthetics don't have to destroy each other. The battle for Ranok. This proves your reception. Finish your war. We will be waiting. Shepard. We can confirm that the Geth are no longer being directed by the old machines. We are free. You did it, Shepard. The Geth fleet has stopped firing. They're completely vulnerable. Then stop firing yourself. Shepard Commander, the Geth only acted in defense after the creators attacked. Do we deserve death? What are you suggesting? Our upgrades. With the old machine dead, we could upload them to all Geth without sacrificing their independence. You want to upload the Reaper code? That would make the Geth as smart as when the Reaper was controlling them. Yes, but with free will. Each Geth unit would be a true intelligence. We would be alive, and we could help you. Yes. Our fleet is already attacking. Uploading the code would destroy us. Shepard, you can't choose the Geth over my people. Do you remember the question that caused the creators to attack us, Talizora? Does this unit have a soul? Upload the code. Upload the code to the Geth. Tally, call off the fleet if you can. <laughs> I believe in Uploading. Legion. Ten percent. This is Admiral Talizora. All units, break off your attack. Belay that order. Continue the attack. Twenty percent. I beg you, do not do this. Please. We regret the deaths of the creators, but we see no alternative. Forty percent. Rally the fleet. No. Nobody else dies today. Legion, keep going. Tally, give me control of the mic. Shepard? All ships, this is Commander Shepard. The Reaper is dead. Stand down. This is Admiral Talizora. Shepard speaks with my authority. And mine as well. Negative. We can win this war now. Keep firing. 60%. The Geth are about to return to full strength. If you keep attacking, they'll wipe you out. Your entire history is you trying to kill the Geth. You forced them to rebel. You forced them to ally with the Reapers. 80%. The Geth don't want to fight you. If you can believe that for just one minute, this war will be over. You have a choice. Please. Kill us alive. Kill us alive. All units, hold fire. Yes, thank God. Error. Copying code is insufficient. Direct personality dissemination required. Shepard Commander, I must go to them. I'm... I'm sorry. It's the only way. No problem, man. You go help your people. Legion, the answer to your question was yes. I know, Tally. But thank you. Ah, that's what he meant. Commander. Admiral Run. I heard your ship made a crash landing. I didn't. Glad you got out in one piece. I was listening over the radio. If Hanagara hadn't stopped... He did. We have taken heavy losses. I don't know if we can. Where are we supposed to go? Come to the Geth. 
You are welcome to return to Rannoch at Moron with us. Legion? No, I'm sorry, Commander. Aww. Legion sacrificed itself to give us all intelligence. It will be honored. Good. And we will honor Legion's promise. The Geth fleet will help you retake Earth, and our engineers will assist in building the Crucible. Hell yes! Ours, of course. Admiral, had you considered possible settlement sites? We... The southern continent had excellent farmland, as I recall. Are you... gonna be okay? I believe so, Commander. Thank you. And now... The Quarians and the Geth can unite and live on Rannoch as it should have been all those centuries Shopping ago. Shopping for another house? Yeah. Beachfront property. Claim it fast. It's a buyer's market. <sighs> you okay? I know working with the Geth will be difficult. I'm not staying. I'm coming with you. That's not why I came. I wasn't going to ask. Why not? Because I respect you, damn it. You think I don't want you to come with me? So ask me. I Tell can't. Me. I don't know how much time we have left. I don't know if we can beat the Reapers. But whatever happens, I want to be with you. <laughs> Sweet talker. I bet you say that to every guy who gets you a homeworld. <laughs> Only the cute ones. You know I'd understand if you needed to stay. I know. But I look at all this. This picture of hope and peace. And all I see is everyone I've lost. My team on Haystrom. My father. Even Legion. I'm mourning a geth. How crazy is that? It's not crazy at all. It's more sane than your ancestors. It is beautiful, though, isn't it? It's wonderful. Yeah, it is. It'll be years before we can live without our suits completely. But right now... Wait, are we? It'd be kind of weird to see right her face now, after all this time. I have this. Now that's the way to do it. Keep it a mystery. Call down an orbital strike. Commander Shepard, I understand you've helped resolve the situation with the Geth. Yep, they're in yes, peace Captain. now. Two, in fact. I've read the reports. You ended a war three centuries in the making. With a and peaceful we'll outcome. Help. We have isolated pockets of remaining Geth. As best we can tell, they are Geth bodies loaded with Reaper code. But they are just a tiny fragment of the full Geth fleet. You've done the impossible, Commander. And I may be able to provide help of my own. How so? I've received information from my government. It's too sensitive to discuss over an unsecured channel. Fair enough. What if I come to the Citadel? Yes, that would be best, Commander. I'll be waiting for you in Counselor Udina's office. That's not uh, creepy or anything. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on Midcom. Ah, uh, but I did it. I did it. I brokered peace! <laughs> hey, Commander, something on your Deliver mind. the most gal uh, most of the Galaxy of War assets. Ah, most of them. So I guess seventy five percent or so. Neat. That was the achievement that I just got. I'm not sure if it showed up. I'm so used to reading the things when they don't appear. <laughs> hey, galactic readiness. What's our state of readiness, Admiral? Given the situation everywhere else, as close as we can be, you've done well, Shepard. All right, and allied forces. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support, while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. Asarian Solarians. How about the Asarian Solarians? Since the coup attempt, the Asari have stepped up to the plate. They're committing fleets and sending a science team to work on the Crucible. And believe it or not, they promised us the Destiny Ascension. They haven't forgotten you saved it three years ago. Yay! Solarians? And the Solarians? They sent the entire fleet as a thank you for rescuing their counselor. Yay! I guess they managed to overlook the Genophage cure. Take that, Dalatris. 
Krogan and Turians. What about the Turians and Krogan? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnog Rex running the show is a bonus for us. Yep. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachanka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. The Rachni. What about the Rachni? I wouldn't have believed it, but the Rachni are helping us build the Crucible. You're kidding. No, I think we already did this one. But still. Mass it's nice to get this in hindsight. I bumped on the fan. Or two about waging a galactic war. No problems with them then? Other than scaring the hell out of our engineers, no. Not a lot of small talk going on there. Alright. Reaper progress. What's the Reaper situation? It's not trending well. Even if you did buy Radix some time. Our threat projections show the Reapers will gain the advantage on most other fronts. And now the Asari are a prime target. They're the most advanced race in the galaxy. We'll soon find out if that means anything. Why pick me? If I may, Admiral. I have a personal question. Speak freely, Commander. Why me? Why put me in charge of all this? Because I'm the because protagonist? you're the only son of a bitch I've got who knows how to kill Reapers. Anyone can. You just have to be smart and hope you get lucky. Anyone can figure it out. Your dossier says otherwise, Shepard. You stopped the Batarian slavers on Elysium all those years ago. What you did, the people who survived that ordeal still thank you by name. That was enough? And because of that, you think I qualify to save the galaxy? Shepard, let me tell you something that I've learned the hard way. You can pay a soldier to fire a gun, you can pay him to charge the enemy and take a hill, but you can't pay him to believe. I don't follow, sir. When you went up against Sovereign, there was no good reason to believe you'd win. But your crew didn't seem to care, they went along anyway. Your trip through the Omega-4 Relay? That was a suicide mission, if there ever was one. Yet there your crew was, standing beside you, proud to serve. Why? Because they believed in you, their leader. That's what I need now. Where we're taking them is liable to get pretty hairy, and I know you're the one who will get us to the other side. Thank you, sir. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. Uh, link to hack it. I can just do it. Deliver most of the Galaxy War outfits. Yay! Yep, that is indeed most. Almost 69. Damn. I wonder, like, how many things I might have missed to not get, like, full. Thank you, thank you. I found work to do. Talizor. Shepard, just one late now. I'm going to join Adams in engineering. It seems like the best place for me to help as long as I'm coming with you anyways. Please drop by when you have a minute. Progress report. Shalaran Vosranok. Commander. With assistance from the Geth, our fleet is nearly back to full strength. We have focused mostly on the efforts on providing evacuation assistance and support for the Turian fleet, while the Geth harass the Reapers. Even with our newfound peace, it seemed foolish to risk an incident by putting our forces in closer proximity. I understand from Admiral Xin that the Crucible project continues well, though Xin herself seems dissatisfied with the technological capabilities of the device. Though eccentric, she is also brilliant. Hopefully she will find some way to improve its functionality. I would have never have believed you could talk Han down, Commander. Take care of Tali Zor for me. Let's talk the Quarian War. It may be hard to believe after we just went through, but the rest of the galaxy is barely aware the Quarians ever went into the Vale, let alone started a war with the Geth. We're sitting on the major piece of history here. I have material from all the players except you. Can I get you in the cabin for an hour and get you to talk on vid? Sure. Alright, we'll go do the interview, then we'll go about talk to everyone. Head to, cause... Let me check my journal quickly. Priority, the Citadel. This is the third time I think there's been a priority citadel. Ah, look at all my things. I'm missing one ship, damn it. Trainer, can you send up Diana Allers? She wants to talk to me. She's on her way, Commander. I am doing an interview. I'm sure you've got a million questions. I narrowed it down to 40. <laughs> Let's see how you do with the top 10. Commander, the last time most of us heard about Geth, they were attacking the citadel alongside Sovereign. Yes, and you should know that was a minority of the Geth. 
Most of them are not hostile to organics. Is that how you explain that they're allies and no longer dangerous robots who stick humans on spikes? The Geth are misunderstood. What you have to realize is that despite their reputation, most Geth are not inherently violent. The Quarians attacked them. The Geth fought back in self-defense just like any organic would. Now that we've freed the Geth from Reaper control, they'll want payback for their enslavement. But you're going to take an army of synthetics to fight Reapers with untold hacking abilities. What's keeping the Reapers from reprogramming the Geth like they have before? The Geth have been upgraded. The Geth are extremely intelligent, and they put incredible thought into solving this problem. They're not going to turn again. I bet my life on it. Now here's a question from a Batarian on Omega. Commander Shepard, if the mass relays can be destroyed... <laughs> So did I miss anything? Do you have any questions? You gonna go file your story now? Well, if you don't mind. Go tell the galaxy what we've done. They could use some good news. Aye aye, Commander. Booyah. Codex, Desperate Measures. And more Geth Core. Alright, let's see. Eh, yeah, just I like the one that I currently have. Gaze upon my lovely fishies, they're not all dead. I did read up, and apparently if you don't feed your fish in Mass Effect 2 after every mission, they die. And that's why the fish kept disappearing. I was a bad owner. Then again, I didn't know that the game would actually implement something like that, but that's me. <laughs> Upgrade them a talk. Just because I can. Let's head to engineering so we can talk to Tally. Wait, wrong way. Dobby, what do you think about our new yeoman and this trainer? She's not a yeoman, she's a communication specialist. What's a yeoman? You're barking up the wrong tree, Kenneth. You're not her type. Oh, well. Perhaps you should go and talk to her then. Maybe I should. Nobody's barking up my tree. If it works out, be sure to take the deal. Silly man. Can't be. No. I guess that's right. Hello there, Tally. Hey, Tally. How's it going? Oh, sorry. I didn't hear you. It is quite loud in here. I just got communication from the fleet. Sorry, uh, from Ramok. I want to be. In the old days, I'd send any new technology I found back to the fleet. I should probably be doing that with the agriculture samples now. I, I don't know anything about raising crops. <laughs> How are your people doing? It's crazy. The Geth are helping. Setting up housing, adapting power systems. They are doing in weeks what would have taken us years. Peace is a wonderful Geth thing. even uploading into the suits of Quarian volunteers. They're rewriting environmental functions, jump-starting our immune systems. How can they do that? It doesn't seem possible. The Geth are software, not hardware. They can transfer themselves from a normal body into anything with enough processing power. They're mimicking infections, so the host can adapt without getting sick. It's like making a vaccine. Utterly amazing! So the Quarians won't have to wear those suits anymore? Well, in a few years. It doesn't seem possible, but yes, in a few years, with Geth improvements, we won't need them. Yay. We might still wear them. The suits have become part of our society. But a rupture won't be a death sentence. Utterly fantastic. Today, on Ravok, there are Quarian children who will grow up healthy and strong, thanks to the Geth. They owe that to you. No. I'd have killed the Geth with no regrets. And I'd have been wrong. Thank you. Anytime. Just let me know if you let a Geth upload itself in there. <laughs> <laughs> no, the only person who gets inside my suit is you. Kinky. Nothing stands between us now. Whatever the galaxy throws at us, I'll be at your side. By the way, I left something for you up in your cabin. Go have a look. Hopefully it's not a bomb. 
Well, that's super cool. So like, beyond just, oh, you got to save everyone, you actually hear the cool advancements that are happening. But I wonder what it will be. Oh. oh, it's her face. Not all that big of a reveal. Just looks kind of human. Granted, most of her head is covered up, so... Still hard to overall get a an idea, but still cool. Kind of funny that the only way to get that is to romance Tally. And then you get to find the true secret of the Quarian people. They're mostly human. Appearing. So that kind of... I think it could would have been cool if it was... If they made the Quarians a bit more... Not beastly, but kind of like along the lines of the Turians to a degree. Kind of in that direction of alien. Because we already have the... We already have the uh, Asari to be the mostly human aliens. Then again, it took Shepard, them three games to show us the face. Never a moment when the Normandy's on tour, is there? Nope. Any word from Palavin? Some. And I don't like what I'm hearing. The Krogan are there in force, but they're just slowing the Reapers down, not stopping them. I'm not sure it's going to be enough. You hear anything from your family? But I did hear from Primarch Victus. He wanted my advice on fleet strength when the Crucible is ready. Still can't get used to people asking me things like that. Hmm. What did you tell Victus? What did you say? I said, at some point, we're going to have to decide if our fleets keep defending Palavin or we go on the offensive. Can't do both? Not with the beating we're taking. Like I said, not the sort of questions I'm used to answering. Why not? You're a good leader. You know what you're doing, Garrus. Trust me, everyone can see that. Maybe. But you spend so much time on the outside trying to get in, and when you do, it's... not what I expected. How so? All the questions, and every one of them with a million lives riding on the answer. You do the best you can with what you know. It's no different than your days at CSEC. You're right. Though I'm starting to understand why the galaxy needs cold-hearted dictators every now and then. They get things done? They don't give a damn about the consequences. Suppose that's what it's going to take, Shepard. The ruthless calculus of war. Ten billion people over here die, so twenty billion over there can live. It's very I'll harsh. Are you? Eh. I think it's not acceptable. We must find a third route. If we reduce this war to arithmetic, we're no better than Reapers. I guess I can't argue with that. You managed peace between the Geth and the Quarians. Maybe there is another way. Probably not against the Reapers. I don't think we'll be able to broker peace with them. They're super, like, probably millions of years ancient beings. They're, like, long for nothing more than their order. But still wonder what, like, made them. Something had to have made them. I hear you were on the ground with the Reaper. He fired up at us a few times. Joker pulled the Normandy through some insane maneuvers to stay out of the line of fire. Huzzah! It's hard being in a fight like that, especially when you're not the one flying the ship. Joker's one of the best, though. At first I was nauseous, swinging around with my safety harness. <laughs> but then I was furious. Just... <laughs> enraged. I wanted that thing dead. You didn't want the Reapers dead when they attacked Earth? I wanted them defeated. I wanted Earth saved. But I never wanted to physically tear them in half and watch them blow up. Harsh. Congratulations, uh, trainer. I believe you've discovered your fight or flight instinct. Perhaps I should have stayed with Chess. <laughs> Although now I think I'm spoiled by the lack of explosions. You need Super Chess 3D. The ultra violence. First person chess. But it's a battle royale. You know, the Quarians have done pretty well with those suits. Maybe they can make something like that for you. <laughs> yeah, they have. Protective medical exoskeleton. I could even get one with racing stripes. So what's the problem? Looks like walking around in heavy armor totally screws with my spatial awareness. I wear heavy armor. 
and my spatial awareness is perfect. Not that heavy. Uh, you crashed the last shuttle, you blue Vega. Lol. <laughs> I need to feel my balance shift when I'm flying. I need to feel the ship moving with me. You take that away. I don't know. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not me. Yeah, I get that. Interesting. Plus, have you seen Tally? Come on, I don't have the hips to carry a ah. like that. Gotta hand it to you, Commander. That's the first time I've seen someone end a war by yelling. I couldn't kill the Geth. They After were innocent. seeing what the Geth Rebellion really looked like, I figured they deserved a chance. Thank you, Commander. I doubt many organics would have trusted a synthetic race. I mean, we've but been through we a lot. two fleets for the price of one. We didn't lose anybody. Except Legion. Yeah. Before it sacrificed itself. Legion referred to itself as I instead of we. I didn't even notice. Yeah? So? The singular pronoun indicates Legion's independent personality had fully actualized. In its last moments, it was not an avatar of the Get Consensus. It was a person. That's what I figured. Well, when the Get Fleet helps us retake Earth, I guess we'll owe that to him. What's on your mind, Edie? I was just reflecting. The Quarians' historical era was not making the Get enough like them. I'm not sure I understand. Yeah, Units what's that? Networked intelligences will trend toward cooperation for mutual benefit. But units with central heuristics establishing an individual personality, such as myself, develop preferences. These preferences form attachments that keep my calculations from devaluing the worth of the lives aboard the Normandy. Huh. You're saying the Geth turned on the Quarians because they aren't individuals. That is my theory. But it is limited to a sample size of one society. The only other notable synthetic society is the Reapers, and we do not know if they govern by consensus as the Geth do. Do me a favor. Don't ask them. <laughs> I mean, from what we saw from the uh, beginning of the Rebellion, or like not even beginning, kind of the middle of it, there was... Bup, 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 that one Geth who was staying with their creator and even sounded a bit sad when they died. And now, things are good. I did good today. Alright. Hades Nexus things! Things to scan! Scanning! Things to scan, things to scan, things to scan, scan, scan. All right, so uh, I'll have to look at the actual save. I found something. Please don't come and eat me. I just scan two times. Please don't come and eat me. I only scan twice. I only scan twice. I only scan twice. Alliance Frickit Hong Kong. Yeah, so they went to space too. And 50%. Huzzah. Let's see. Hmm. I'll head to Sheol. Save. Jump to Palm Yacht and hope that they also have like... Signal confirmed. All right, this one's tiny. This is probably a singular. It would be kind of hilarious if there was a hidden, destroyed fuel ship not all that far away. Prothean Sphere! All right, we will save. So we don't want to... Uh, 323 is our first save into this. I just love getting more access. Why do we have two things? Hades Gamma and Hades Nexus? Why aren't they two called Hades? I found something. Okay, they did not like me scanning here. Why do they not like me scanning here? I'm scanning for the good of humanity. Alliance Frigate Leipzig. And Alliance First Fleet. It's just like updated. At least this one will be somewhat easy. To 
just have to scan about. Grab and run. Only a hundred. Grab and run. Reapers eluded. I'll head back here, grab the fuel from the the one, but where was the one? Oh, we already have it. Good. 380. Huzzah. And now we'll head to Hoplos. Well, first I guess I'll save here. Just to be safe. You know, the upper thing could really use a chair. Just standing all day, every day. And now we save again, because now we're here. Bleg. Signal confirmed. Let's see how many there are in here. Obelisk of Kaza. 50%. You know, I kind of wish that the space stations would ping when you're, like, within scanning range of them. What the fuck? Faster than light jump successful. Where is it? There you are, darling. Evasion successful. Come on, put me back where we were. Huzzah. Aha. Faster than light jump successful. See ya, suckers. You cannot catch Captain Man. He is the man, because he is Captain Man. Only 10%. That is scary. All right, well, we'll head to the Cilean Nebula. Then we'll head to the Diddly Dee, see if there's anything else potentially scan for because maybe thing opened up, maybe, perhaps. Oh, that's why, because a ton of fucking places opened up. Neat. Hopefully, well, at the same time, I luckily I don't have to go and ask people on the Citadel, hey, what do you need me to do? Because I'll just be able to scan and grab. I found something. So yeah, you can read, but there's so much reading in this game. Alright, now I shall come over here and save. Ugh, ugh. Hopefully this will be 50%, then we can go grab fuel and flee to the next sector. Our Molly sniper unit. Evasion successful. Then we'll enter. Because we're all the way over here, we can just grab this and go. See ya, suckers. Reapers eluded. But that one that's like on the edge of known space of not known space, but like the edge of all reality over there. That's gonna be a pain to get. Signal confirmed. I hate the Reaper alertness. I mean, sure, I annihilated one on Rannoch. That probably pissed them off, but come on. It's war. 50%. We take and go. 
and somehow that wasn't enough to alert them. So yeah, we're definitely not going to try and go from this place to the far, far one. That's going to require a full refuel and maybe not even that. I found something. All right. How many things we got to worry about on this place? Only one, two, God forbid three. Code of the Ancients. 50%. All right, we shall save over and we shall scan about like crazy to find, well, then again, it doesn't really matter, but. Mm. I yoink and I go. Let's see. Faster than light jump successful. This is ever so slightly closer. Let's go. God forbid. Now we definitely want to save scum because that is super far away from everywhere in reality and I don't want reapers to come eat my face. Signal confirmed. Oh, two planets? Two planets? Two. Shocking that two planets, normally, it's only one planet per place. Shocking. Rings of Loon. 33%. Mm -mm -mm. Utterly horrifying. <laughs> Just credits. Because, you know, that's what I need right now. Credits. All right. Now, we scan like crazy. We grab, we run. See you, suckers! Also, can I say, this is super pretty. The blue with the red and meh. Beautiful. And I don't think the percentage changed here. But I got to know. I got to at least look. Nope, Masana, that's, we already know that. Bleg, Masana was where the, so yeah, it looks like the diddly D from the Nimbus cluster is uh, forsaken for all eternity. Cannot be gotten. We shall quickly look over everyone, just the Nimbus cluster, which didn't have anything before. I think that was always 80 and that was always 88. Now nah, let's double check here just to be safe. More likely it was just another... Oh, fuel, who cares? So let's see. So yeah, that's just the 33% that would have uh, gone into the overall percent. Welp, welp. Let's head to the Citadel. See what they have to say. Drop off things. And considering that we're getting close to the... Well, it feels like we're getting close to the end of the game. It feels like that, considering how much war assets and, like... And if I think about it, when we started the game, we started on the Citadel, technically, but one of the first things that happened was we were on the Citadel and the Turian Counselor asked a favor of us. Then later the Salarian Counselor asked us a favor and brought us back, which was the Cerberus attack. And now the Asar Asari has brought us to the Citadel. So, yeah. 
If I feel like there's a point of no return coming up anytime soon, I will do the uh, Citadel and Dr. Bryson's Lab DLC thingies. Alliance docks. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Take me to Le Presidium Commons, because I'm sure things there, there are going to be there. And then I'll check the map. Let's see. Researcher tally. Docking area, refugee. All right. So we'll... Around the same place that Tally is, is a researcher. We can hand the thing off, talk to Tally. And then head over to the docks, refugee camp. Of course, we can have ships at the colony in 36 hours. Do you need medical support? No, evacuating the colony is more than enough. Thank you, Ambassador. Ambassador? I'm coordinating actions for the fleet while we're here. Evacuating colonies, bolstering Turian defense lines. Neat. Huh. I think it was right here. Three years ago to the day. Really? What? This was where Saren's assassins fired Oh. At. I'd just gotten to the Citadel. I didn't think I needed my barriers up. My mistake. I'm so sorry. You never told me about this. How bad was it? Got me in the arm. They used polonium rounds. I was running a fever in minutes. It was the first time I'd been really hurt on my pilgrimage. I ran to the council embassy, asked for protection, offered the data on Seren. And they refused? The Turian clerk called me Suit Rat. He threatened to have me tossed off the station if I didn't leave. I wish that clerk could see you now. He just did. Yeah. That was him back there. I don't think he remembers me. I'm proud of you helping. And you're assisting him in spite of that. This war is too big for old grudges. You showed me that. Yeah. We are at peace with the Geth. I can't waste my time on a Turian who made me angry. Besides, it all worked out. I made it to the wards. You found me. Happy ending. And now the Turians will get the aid they desperately need. I nearly reminded him who I was, made him apologize, rubbed his nose in it. I couldn't have uh, I both faulted you for that. <laughs> the difference is that you helped when it counted. The difference was you. Oh, that's sweet. Everything looks so peaceful. That's oh, sweet. Courtyard, so oh, it's probably over there. Damn it. That's sweet. Kind of annoyed that I'll have to do a different uh, playthrough in which I have to romance like Liara or uh, Caden or Ashley to get the romance everybody throughout the entire trilogy. I've recovered the obelisk of Karza. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. You have? It's amazing. Thank you, Commander. That's going to help immeasurably with some very sensitive work. Huzzah. Just doing what I can to bolster everything. Just sad that I missed out on some things, like apparently the Eden Prime. Spectre status recognized. Please select one moment, please. Like the Eden Prime resistance. I didn't get enough Cerberus data, I guess. Alright, let's see. He is in Bay E28, which is four around here. <laughs> I like the kind of background stories that are happening. Oh yeah, you. Here you go, dude. I found a Prothean Sphere on Gehenna. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. Call them right now. There you go, dude. Mm -hmm. I those are my also, 
this kind of implies that James is gambling against refugees and taking refugee money. James, how dare you? Also, I do find it a bit weird that... Oh, wait, I forgot. I didn't look at any both. That they added new romance potential in this game. And it's just like, really? All right, so it seems Purgatory, then Huerta Memorial. And then we go to the embassies. Now arriving at ward level Purgatory. I recovered the code of the ancients from Takuna. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. With shock and joy. <laughs> I'm forever amused that, and delighted that they still have Elcor running around. Uh, it's just, they're one of my favorite species and we don't nearly see them enough. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Excuse me, I recovered the rings of Alun. They're waiting in Bay D24. That's wonderful, thank you. My people will treat this miraculous find as a call to support their local hospitals. You say, in front of a bunch of... At least one dead person. Everything is so great. Huzzah. Meanwhile, person is dying. I wonder if I should run around. Cause, surely, because I think we're entering the end-end game. So I don't think if I run around I'll hear any more conversations about, Oh, this and that. So I'm a little... Yay! They have all these people out here when there's an empty room. What, can I just leave Caden in there forever? I just realized I lost an- Why is it that everybody from Mass Effect 2 are the ones that are like, dying? I don't think Rex is really in that much danger of dying in this game. Garrison, well, maybe Tally if you mess up the the Geth stuff. So yeah, I, sorry, I can't. I I missed the the things on the. R. Dot Yakshi. And bop. Forces to the new coordinates. Trust me. Perhaps you could send the girls to your family. Yeah, just like blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. I'll quickly check the terminal. The Spectre terminal, see if there's anything I can. You think there would be more Spectres in here coordinating stuff? And now I will go talk to Bailey and pray to God that bad things don't happen once I talk to the counselor. Hey, Shepard. I have to admit the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze, or in my case, limping. <laughs> limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. Odina. All that time you were working for Odina. Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead. And you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Odin and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. Just want to make sure I didn't no do that one yet, rest. or whatever. Yeah, you too, Shepard. I'm just happy that I did a lot. Didn't get like a hundred percent. But I don't think that's really functionally possible. I probably should have saved. Hmm. Going over anything for like worries and fears. File secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. How's the investigation Did you find going? Something? 
The council has ordered a full review into Donald Udina's activities. Fair enough. We're still piecing together his coup attempt. But that isn't why I asked you here. The situation is growing urgent for my people. We are aware your crucible is still missing a key component. Yeah. The catalyst. Do you know something? I completely for forgot expected, about the catalyst. But there is a artifact on our homeworld, Thessia, known only to highest levels of my government. What is it? With any luck, it's a means to help you locate the catalyst. The artifact is kept in a temple located at these coordinates. I've ordered a scientific team to meet you there. Hmm. Why the secrecy? If this artifact is so important, why keep it hidden? Every species in the Citadel has its secrets, Commander. Even at the end of but the world? But this one, in the wrong hands, would upset the balance of galactic power. The Reapers are doing that right now. Which is why I'm bringing this to you. Thank you. I appreciate the help. It's you who will be helping us. The Matriarchs are growing desperate. For the first time in our history, Thessia is vulnerable. For all our intellect, we're outmatched by Reaper firepower. I'll do what I can. Whether you know it or not, you've become the sole ray of hope in a very dark night. Goddess be with you. Alright, we're going to go see Thessia. Priority Thessia. What? Urgently, human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? Holding sorrow, the Kuna, my home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please, all the other races have turned us aside. Elcor warriors? How do your people fight? Proudly, with BI-assisted infantry, our soldiers carry heavy weapons into battle mounted on their backs. Mixed pride and shame, our enemies have called us living tanks, as well as names less flattering. Well, that's interesting. I'll do what I can. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry. The Kuna burns. Severus forces have attacked the Turian colony of hmm. The Kuna Elcor extraction. Huh. Wait, Please I'm gonna take a... Nope. Gonna take a quick look at everything, because... Make sure nothing else popped up. Da, 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 da. Nope, nothing popped up. Take me to the Normandy docking bay. Now arriving at docking bay but that's interesting. Is it actually called Takuna Homeworld? Yes, 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 Codex. Yeah, Takuna, Alcor Extraction. Interesting. Because he's been just there in the embassy for so long, I kind of forgot that he, like, existed. I just kind of passed him over. Hmm. Anything? Commander? Nah, yeah, just Commander. I'm gonna go check up on my things on the war room, see what our presumable... Well, then there is the Takuna Elcor Extraction. Yeah, like any day now. Oh, look at that! It's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. We have over seven thousand, and I am going to assume that the max is seven thousand five hundred or so. Though that number could have been waggled about a bit by uh, DLC additions. That's another thing. What are the DLCs gonna freaking do? I'm gonna have to really buckle down and decide when to do the do you DLCs. Feel awkward being the only Turian on the ship? I don't know. Should I? 
I just mean not having anyone else like you around. Mm, doesn't seem to bother Liara. Yeah, but it's Liara. But she can eat their food. Lol. I can't believe my people are working with the guests. It's a wonderful day indeed. Breaking I now, the Exodus cluster under heavy attack. Eden Prime and Terra Nova about to fall. Eden Prime has just Do been under so much them, shit. Or join the Solarians at the Horsehead Nebula. How many worlds can we afford to lose? The full analysis tonight in the battle space. Commander. Okay. I guess I should try and talk to Javik. The only conflict you should concern yourself with, you are proving that humans are capable soldiers. Diplomacy, but I question what the hell? peace you have brokered. No such thing is possible between machines. Arr. I would have destroyed the synthetics without hesitation. And these quarians, let's just hope they are reliable allies. It is difficult to trust this species that hides behind masks. Well, I mean, they have a reason. It's called immune systems. <laughs> His, he, too, he was like say, saying two different things at the same time. Either that or somebody messed up his overall diddly d on uh, like the the word timings maybe like and now this one will play after that one finishes. All right, guess now we have to be on the lookout for anything else. A new place. Locate secret artifact. But where's the? Wait, Selene Nebula, 90%? I'm gonna quickly take a look, because maybe it'll tell me in the journal where... Dakun? No, just Dakuna. Just Dakuna. Where is Dakuna? I'm going to assume that that is where Thessia is. Kind of weird that the other thing isn't showing up. Fontes, 66%. It wasn't like that. I 100% of this goddamn place. What? Successful. Well, Reapers eluded. All right, interesting. This is what I get for playing silly box. How did I miss this? But where's the Kuna? Or was that the Kuna? Faster than light jump successful. I have to know. Is that the Kuna? Yeah, it's Takuna. Uh-huh. Evasion successful. All right, I'm going to save again. And I'm going to click on Takuna and see if I can, like, actually land or anything. More than likely, I grabbed what I could. Nope, that's it. All right. Weird that Takuna... Like, they didn't specify where Takuna was... But okie dokie there. Sure. We're gonna head back and uh, talk to that their ambassador, I guess. I guess. <coughs> that was just weird. 
Thank God my memory is just like, hmm, this percentage is wrong. Now be careful, don't click lab or apartment. You're clear to dock, Normandy. Take me to the embassies. Transport? I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. Also, how are you alive? How did you survive the takeover? We got your people off to Kuna, Ambassador. Utterly sincere. Thank you for your assistance, Commander. This is not a Jeffrey Candy play. Were you able to evacuate any civilians? Yes. Yay. How many? Not. At least we managed to save some people. I figured there would be like a mission, but no, that's just a scan. Now arriving at docking bay D24. But hey, we did things. All right. Now I guess we head to Thessia. And considering that this is... I'm wondering, I guess, I want to bring Garrus and Tally along like usual. But this is Thessia, the homeworld of uh, Liara. And then it would be interesting to bring like Javik along, but I think at the same time as DLC. Mm, I'm just going to bring my normal, maybe. Mm. I'll just do my normal. Under heavy reaper attack. There's activity across most of the planet. Never mind. Maybe I should bring the arrow along. Can you raise the scientists? Negative. All channels are scrambled across the spectrum. The mission's looking really dicey. This is too important. It's now or never. Yep. Shepard, that's my home down there. I have to go. Well, the shuttle and let's do this. if it's decided for me, then I'll bring Javik along as well, since I can't have my my dynamic duo. Come along. Come fight Reapers, my dude. All right. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh, now that one's super nice. I'll give you the uh, thingy things, and then I'll give the other upgrade thingies to Liara. And then you can also have the super duper pistol. But you can have the powers. Oh, can you only do one power thing at a time? Profound sadness. Now let's take a look. Eh, the minor downgrade isn't that bad. The damage upgrade from that is, like, so minimal. It's hilarious. There we go. Let's -a go. Do I get a max out? Improves the odds of freezing the target by 50%. Decrease frozen target's movement speed. Additional. Increase damage to frozen targets from all sources. Weaken the armor. Hmm. I guess I'll go with that. And I am maxed the fuck out. And from the looks of things, I do need to save the galaxy before I get the final bit. Hilarious. Let's see. Increase singularity's hold duration. Additional enemies can be lifted. Increase impact. That one. Increase damage per second to lifted. Or recharge speed. Your recharge speed is already nuts. Increase expand. Or detonate singularity with the field dies to inflict a lot of damage. Sure. Increase health and armor damage. Squad mates gain? Nah. Increase ammo capacity. Headshot damage. 
Because do, do you even need ammo? Armor weakening the target, just that. Increase da uh, damage and duration. Increase weapon damage taken, damage and duration. And I guess with the last bits, I'll just give you the bare minimum of that. Let's see. Increase damage, increase duration, damage. So it targets movement speed, movement speed, damage, or hmm, overall damage. Per second, even. Pool, increase duration, impact radius. Impact radius. Lift grenade, increase damage, impact radius. Increase damage and in, uh, force of biotic detonation. Increase force of biotic detonation or just force. I guess I'll go for the damage. And then I will upgrade pool and inflict more to lifted. Increase damage to all targets. Eh, damage to lifted. Let's -a go! These coordinates the Counselor gave you are for the Temple of Athame. My mother took me there once. It's several thousand years old. Fifty thousand, maybe. And for some reason, it has classified government funding. Sounds like so Area 51 trail. for Asari. What if we're too late? My people are dying down there. Your empathy is a weakness. You must numb yourself to loss. Asshole. Liara's mother. Didn't Ezia took you to this temple? I was just a child. I thought it was a history lesson, but now, maybe there was more to it. What do you mean? I went digging through her old files. She had heavily encrypted records on this place, some dating back centuries. I still can't crack most of them. Still can't crack? Wow. Whatever's going on, it's well hidden. I studied your mission reports. Your mother was indoctrinated. Yep. But yes. not back then. We had to kill her. Yet it did not stop you from fighting. As I said, steal yourself. Many more lives will be lost. We can't forget we can't the dead. The people are dying. The Reapers may not have mercy, but we do. It is their indifference that gives them power. So you want to become a Reaper? Then let's show them there's another way. I killed a human Reaper. Do you think I should have let that fly? No, hell no. Can't be happening. My home. There's Keep no forgetting. time to mourn. We're exposed up here. Let's get down. You must be Commander Shepard. Lieutenant, Commander, we heard. <laughs> the barrier's been breached. Commander, we'll talk later. Hell yeah. Be gone, be gone. More on the way. Keep firing. No, moderation. I love it that only sometimes do they explode. There's nothing that, like, indicates why. Why can't I just bring this gun with me? It'd be I so nice. That gunship prepped and in the air. Plug that hole! We're on it! Someone get me a location on our snipers! Yes, ma'am. Commander, I'm Lieutenant Curran. We've been told to expect you. My orders are to hold this grid at all costs. I need to get to the the Fane Temple. Shore up the barrier! But our perimeter's collapsing. That is one impressive barrier. 
Unless you can give me a good reason to stay, we're not dying for a field of rubble. What are your orders? What exactly were you told about me? Nothing but your name. Mission details were classified, which just means we'll die without knowing why. I sympathize. I know what that's like, but you have to trust the chain of command. We're not even sure the chain still exists. So what are we doing here? I'm looking for an artifact. We're after a relic inside the temple. It's important. That's what this is all about? One of our outposts has been trying to reach the scientists over there, but we lost contact. Get that gunship moving! Now! It's gonna be new. No. If your relic has lasted this long, it can wait a little longer. I've lost enough people today. I'm pulling the rest of them out. No. I sense you the lineage of a leader. A warrior skill and cunning. They are strong in your teams. But you've grown tired of them. You're exhausted by them. This is weird. Now you worry you don't have the courage left to go on. By the goddess. Prothean. Find your resolve. This war can end if you do. We have the crucible. We're building a Prothean super weapon. It'll win this war. I believe it. This is I wonder what would happen if I didn't bring Javik. Is. What? I just figured, oh hey, maybe Javik will titans. have some kind of Prothean away. idea of what's going on with this Let's artifact sure thingy. More of those bastards. Oh, hey, they knocked it out of the sky. Remember that, because here they come. In slow motion, looking like. I don't even know what that buff they do does. We must find the troll underneath the bridge. I probably should have. Uh, could I have even looked around? I probably should have looked around the uh, Asari outpost a bit longer. On that building, Can I shoot it? Nope, it's getting nuked. No! Damn them! Keep your focus, Liara! Those things are slaughtering my people! In our base, they I hit something. Watch the engine. Don't let them get around us. Dang it. I totally hit his arm. His squibbly little arm. Oh, fuck you. The hurt boxes on these things are so wonky. Watch it yourself. They just won't stop. More of them ahead. Dang it. More pot, more rack knife. That door ahead looks like our way out of this mess. Another mutant is burning. Shut up. Doubtful that we'll find anything because, again, this feels like the end game. So I don't think there will be that many, oh, hey, go here, find thing on planet so you can deliver on Citadel. Hopefully the game will have... 
hopefully the game will have a kind of point of no return-ish feeling to it. Then again, I uh, mainly because of the DLCs. I want to do all a bunch of things before. Then again, I am kind of like at the super duper end, so I probably should do the DLCs soon. I still can't face those things. My own people. When we fought the Reapers, they turned our own children against us. I can't imagine that. They assumed we would hesitate to kill them. Did you? What answer would you prefer? None. Let's stop talking about this. Above us! Big boy. They're gonna get nuked. Told you. I watch head when I can shoot. Kill zone for us or them. Interesting times, Javik. Especially interesting for you. This nightmare never ends. The hell it won't. We get to this artifact and we can all wake up. Hopefully. Run Asari Commando. But there are Go things there. Lol. Dead. They're all dead. We tried punching through to the scientists, but I'm all that's left. What about reinforcements? No we way. Had gunships flying support. The things got too hot with that reaper. They can't chance it. We could use their help. I know it's rough, but I don't see another way in without their help. Have I told you how much I hate this war? Understandable. Talent swarm. This is outpost Tychus. Is there anybody left on this frequency? We are in need of immediate air support. Commander Shepard is here. Copy, this is Talon 1. I'm on the way. Talon 5 inbound. Ground targets confirmed. Weapons are hot. Light them up. Talon 1, watch the jamming. Target acquired. And the hit. Goodbye. The We could probably could have taken them. This is Talon 5. Whatever you're gonna do, you better do it now. Go, Commander! I'll cover you from here. Commander Shepard, I've got your back. Let's get you into that tunnel. Freaking hate barriers. Quit knocking my ass. I mean, they kind of did that with Destiny Ascension. And Sovereign. Maybe. 
Pop. And you even dodged that. Want to get into cover. And the game was an asshole. Everything's clear. By the way, we're gonna throw the heaviest things in the game at you. No way I wasn't doing damage to the one. How oh, dare game. Looks like we're in the clear. Let's get inside. It appears that Temple has been barricaded. Let me take a look. I kind of just stepped aside. It's military grade encryption. I think I can override it. Neat. Do religion and military always mix among us, Ari? No. This is unusual. Especially since few still follow the Afame Doctrine. Definitely interesting looking. Hello? Is anyone there? Probably not. Something is wrong. Your scientist should be here. Take a look around. Maybe one of these artifacts is what we're looking for. What's this? The goddess of fame's shield. Legends say she used it to protect Thessia when the heavens grew angry. Our ancestors were probably misinterpreting a meteor shower. It was an asteroid strike. We deflected it. You mean the Prothians? Huh. But that would imply a fame. Is not what you believe her to be. Just keep looking. Could this be the artifact? It's a sword. I don't think so. It's the goddess of fame's sword. Myths say she wielded it against the jealous gods who threatened our ancestors. They were a race called the Ouroboros. Thessia had vast resources. We protected you from them. Are you actually suggesting that the Protheans intervened in our past? It's more than a suggestion. I find it strange your scientists would abandon their own planet. They wouldn't. What about this one? It's just a writing. from one of our earliest religious texts, the Athame Codex. I doubt this is it. It describes Lucin, a Thames guide who taught our ancestors about the stars. Your species was deemed to have potential. Pity you didn't live up to it. Asshole. Could this be the artifact? It's Prothean. I don't think so. That's a kind of, of Lucin, one of a Thames servants who walked among my ancestors, bestowing knowledge. And you don't see the resemblance? He was no servant of an imaginary goddess. He was Prothean. What was a Prothean doing here? Another page from the Codex. Not very useful. It talks about a Thames guide granting us the gift of biotics as a reward for worshipping her. That gift involved years of genetic research. I... Uh, this is almost too much to take. More Codex? How about this? It's more from the Codex. Doesn't look promising. It describes how a Thame taught our ancestors mathematics. Before that, you could only count as high as your toes. We took pity. Doesn't look useful. That's Janiri, a Thames guide who brought enlightenment to Thessia long ago. He was no servant of an imaginary goddess. He was Prothean. Just want to make sure. What do you know about this? Another codex. A fragment from the codex. It's not what we need. It describes how a Thames guide, Janiri, gave my people seeds. He taught them the seasons so they could grow crops. We didn't want you to starve. 
<laughs> we didn't want you to starve. <laughs> what are we looking at here? A primitive rendition of the goddess of fame. She's speaking to her ancient Azari followers. I don't think this is the artifact. Another one of your myths that somehow looks Prothean. Yeah. Why well, is your goddess a Prothean? It's I'm guessing these are the scientists. How'd they die? What are we looking at here? Same thing. A primitive rendition of the goddess of fame. She's speaking to her. So lots of Protheans were here, but how did those two researchers die? Their throats. What happened to them? They've been slit. The Reapers didn't do this. Assassin. We're going to have to figure. Kai Lang. Who's that supposed to be? The goddess of fame herself. It's a relic of the old faith. Then why does the fame speak Prothean? What do you mean? There is something here. I can sense it. In this temple? I admit it is strange this place has been so well preserved. Because it's Prothean make? The fame does have great historical significance. We once believed our gods were separate from the world, looking down on us. Let me guess, she's gonna look down on me. Prothean beacon here. What? You're sure? It's not something you forget. But why hide it? The answer is obvious. Power and influence. Your people are holding the knowledge of my race for their own gain. That can't be. I can't believe my people would keep this a secret. Explains Asari's superiority. A beacon like this could explain why Asari are so advanced. This temple is thousands of years old. Time enough to make serious progress. That doesn't make it true. Even a small amount of data would give your species an edge. Or are you insulted that your government didn't involve you? We all learned from the Protheans. The Mars ruins are where humanity got Mass Effect technology. And we learned a bit from the ruins of the Inusanum, the race that came before us. It was our secret for centuries. Asari should share knowledge. Well, if it is true, the Asari should have shared this knowledge. We might not have been in this mess if they had. You don't know that, Shepard. We don't know what's going on here. I know we The counselor has pointed out. us here. The few records I can access talk about tapping into Prothean data streams, reconstructing matrices, none of which I see here. I do. The activation process has begun. But yeah, where's Kai Lang? By he the he's threaded some throats. Look around. There must be more of these connections. Incredible. The beacon seems to think you're Prothean, Shepard. I kind of it must am. be the cipher you got back on Pharos years ago. Or it could be the Prothean standing next to you. No connection here. The end of the war is near. Find what we need, finish the crucible, and vengeance is complete. Oh. We can't just click randomly. There, another one. I can't believe this. Whole this doesn't appear to be a connection. We should keep searching. It's gaining power. It's still not complete. Doesn't look like a connection. What <laughs> are any of the codexes gonna be one? That's a big ass beacon. The activation is complete. We can access the beacon now. Or Kai Lang is gonna come and try and slit my throat. List my sloat. We need to hurry. This place isn't going to Oh hey. A VI. Last very long. Obtaining chronological marker. Hold. Time scale established. Post Prothean cycle confirmed. One of our computers. Reaper present detected. This galactic cycle has already reached its extinction terminus. We need the catalyst. Systems shutting down. Hold on. We need answers. To, to what, what question? question? The catalyst. We need to know what it is to finish the crucible. Neat. A memory of one of my people. I am called Vendetta. An advanced virgin Vendetta. Patrick Van, overseer of the project you refer to as Crucible. How convenient! He died fighting the Reapers in the Battle of Tranvia 9. Your remaining time is 
also at an end. We're all Protheans, so grim. The Crucible. What happened to the Crucible in your time? Why didn't the Proteans deploy it? We were sabotaged from within. A splinter group argued we should dominate the Reapers rather than destroy them. What? It fractured Cerberus? Later we discovered the Separatists were indoctrinated. I knew it! I always suspected as much. Knew that Cerberus and has been indoctrinated. The same problem. Our studies of past ages led us to believe that time is cyclical. Many patterns repeat. Like the Reaper attacks. Fibonacci. The same peaks of evolution, the same valleys of dissolution. The same conflicts are expressed in every cycle, but in a different manner. The repetition is too prevalent to be merely chance. We assume the Reapers were responsible for the pattern. Perhaps. Though I believe the Reapers are only servants of the pattern. They are not its master. Oh, great. Who? So who is the master? I'm Elusive man's weird eyes? Rather than observe. The only certainty is its intention. Galactic annihilation. You now stand at that precipice. Then help us. There's still hope for this cycle. We need to know what the catalyst is. Trillions of lives are at risk. Trillions of lives are always at risk. But if the Reapers have arrived to end your cycle, this discussion is too late. We can break the cycle. We found your plans for the Crucible. We're building it right now. The Crucible is not a protein design. It is the work of countless galactic cycles stretching back millions of years. Each cycle adds to it. Each improves upon it. Thus far, none have successfully defeated the Reapers with it. Give us a chance, mine. Then we'll be the first. Tell us what the catalyst is. Listen to the human. He can be trusted. I detect you are one of us. You are Prothean. It points at you. The last. I am the final hope to avenge our people. Your mission was known to me. Do you believe this present cycle can deliver retribution? They have earned the right to try. Hell Tell yeah. what we need to know. Very well. If you have followed the plans for the Crucible, I will interface with your systems and assist with the catalyst too. Indoctrinated presence detected. Activating security protocol. Kai Lang. Cerberus bastard. You. You killed the scientists. What do you want? Your attention. Someone would like to talk with you. What is it, Tim boy? You indoctrinated piece of shit. Shepard. How did you find this place? The archives. Or did your shadow broker miss that one? Show yourself. I promise I won't miss. Stick to your talents, Dr. Dasani. You've helped uncover the key to subjugating the Reapers. Won't work. Or destroying them. Damn it, Shepard. Destroying the Reapers gains us nothing. How about peace? They're just trying to control us. Think about it. If they wanted all organic life destroyed, they could do it. There would be nothing left. Whose side are you on? What the hell are you talking about? I know them, Shepard. I know how they think. I think you've gotten a little too close to the enemy. No. I'm saying they've got it right. Why kill when you can control? We need to work together. You've been spending too much time with the enemy. They're dragging you over to their side. Their way of thinking. No. I just see things differently. You see them exactly what they want you to see, dude. You'll stop fighting me. You'll join me. Don't ever question my intentions. <laughs> I've sacrificed more for humanity. You've sacrificed other humans, other planets. And don't assume you know me. My methods for dealing with the Reapers are simply more refined. Than you've yours. lost tr You've lost touch. You've forgotten everything you stood for. Cerberus was supposed to be humanity's sword, not a dagger in our back. Poetic, but as usual, you miss the point. The world is more gray than you care to admit. With the Prothean data in this beacon, I can end this conflict, once and for all. You're either with me or against me. There's nothing gray about that. No, I suppose there isn't. Leng, the commander has something I need. Please relieve him of it. And then bring me the data. Understood. Time to kill. I've been hit. Cover me while I recharge. Commander, the ghost. Get to cover. Waste your time. 
Grenade! Shepard is mine now. You've had your fun now. It's a pity the good ones never last. You mean like you? There's only one way this happens. Treat the data. Come on, damn it. Cerberus thanks you for all your hard work. Guess I'm going to have to raid the Cerberus place. Utter bastard. Also, why did they build this place like this where we can fall? Over a pit. I guess we can just blame the Protheans for being so argumentative. And of course the game had to cheat. Throw cutscene power at me. Shepard! Hang on! See, I had the right idea. Shoot down the gunship. in despair. The game could only make me lose by throwing cutscene power at me. Cerberus stopped us. Because they're bastards. What happened? Cerberus was there. We were... We were defeated. We don't know how to finish the Crucible. I... I don't know what to say. Find us Cerberus's bases. What was the situation on Thessia? Dead. Deteriorating fast. The Reapers are there in strength. Then you'll excuse me. 
There are preparations to make. Continuity of civilization to consider. I never thought this day would come. None of us did. I'm... Sorry. They cut me off for once. Asari forces are in full retreat. It is no longer safe for us to remain in this system. Get us out of here. Shepard. I... Nobody could have predicted Cerberus would reach Thessia before us. I should have known, because they're bastards. It's my job to be prepared. No matter what. And now Thessia's lost, as is the data on the catalyst. I'm sick of Cerberus beating us to the punch. Let's kick them in the balls first for a change. I'm with James. Anyone know where they're hiding? Anyone? Um... <laughs> well, there is something. Let's hear it, trainer. I was able to track Kai Leng's shuttle through the relay and extrapolate his destination. But... The signal disappeared in the Yera system. Naturally. It's not just gone, though. The signal is being actively blocked. So they have a... No. That's where I'm the elusive sure, boy is. But something is interfering with all signal activity in that region of space. Commander, the Yera system is home to Sanctuary and little else. Sanctuary is the supposed safe haven for war refugees. Cerberus. Indoctrinating tons of war refugees, I'm guessing. You think it's worth checking out, trainer? Yes, sir. I do. If Specialist Trainer hadn't examined the data so astutely, the interference would have been undetectable. Good work. Nice work, Trainer. You've given us a shot. Now let's make sure we don't waste it. I was stationed on Horizon in the Lyra system, and you were the only Cerberus presence while I was there. It's a slim lead. Let's hope it's the right one. I don't care how slim the leads are at this point. We've come too far to let Cerberus stop us. I want that Prothean data. I want the catalyst. No excuses. Dismissed. That feels like point of no return Commander, to me. Admiral Anderson is available on Bitcom. Look, it's so close. Got so much reputation and it's still not budging. So yeah. Hmm. But then again, hmm. Mm -hmm. Shepard. I heard about Thessia. We were so close, Anderson. So damn close to ending this war. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? Nothing's been easy. I knew going in there wouldn't be a minute of this war that was easy. But watching Thessia fall, and knowing it was my responsibility... Shepard, you know how many times I got my ass handed to me over the years? Surviving the first contact war back in the day was a goddamn miracle. They said I was a hero. I just felt lucky to get out alive. So maybe Kai Lang did beat you. What of it? It could cost us the war. These guys in the Resistance, they know it's a losing proposition. They know the chances of seeing tomorrow are slim to none. But we all signed up anyway. Hell, I'm sitting in London right now staring at rubble. I was born here. And it's You were born in London? Too. So I say point us at the Reapers and we'll take our chances. I'd bet on you. You'll make it, Anderson. When this is all over, you could show me London. Death flag for one of us. It might need a new coat of paint first. This will be over soon. I feel like I'm not gonna make it out of this. It better. Shake this off, Shepard. I will. Anderson out. Like you don't become this much of a legend. Like. Like Shepard boy. And not run into. Super duper mega blig. Damn. Not after we took down that Reaper on Rack. I don't know. Yeah. But there's no way we could have stopped the Reaper on Thessia. The Asari should have jumped in earlier. Commander, Cerberus has attacked a comp facility on Onteron. I've updated the galaxy map. Evacuating Thessia. Good, you opened this message. This isn't actually Asari military command. They're busy tending to what's left of their planet. So you survived 
our fight on Thessia. You're not as weak as I thought, but never forget that your best wasn't good enough to stop me because the game cheated. Now an entire planet is dying because of you lack the strength to win. The Legend of Shepard needs to be rewritten. I hope I'm there for the last chapter. It ends with your death. Lee Riley, Commander. My squad continues to defend the fuel reactor on Scion. The Reapers seem intent on taking it down. Not on my watch. Alright. Check journal. I guess we'll do the communications hub. Hmm. Communications hub and then Horizon. Because I'm sure the game would throw something super duper heavy like... Because, like, while that did have a little bit of Point of No Return flavoring, like, I don't know. I don't think it's full Point of No Return. It's just so big I mission. The elusive man drinks bourbon. It all makes sense now. What do you mean? You love whiskey. Oh, I can, I, I can actually tell where people are. Liara, Javik. Ah, she's in the mess hall. The liquor makes the maniac. Obviously, never experienced the peat aroma of a fine Eli scotch. So, how be things, Commander? We were just talking to Liara. She's a strong one. I'd say her world's just been completely rocked. Completely. Adams and I were just remembering Novaria and the terrible way her mother died. Liara seemed so together afterward. Couldn't have been easy. For weeks, she told me stories about her mother. Me too. I have a feeling she'll be okay. Yeah. Hope so. Is she talking to Javik? The pseudo asshole? Those were all lies back there. They were not. My people weren't animals for your kind to experiment on. You wanted to know more about your history, Asari. Now you do. I have a name. It's Liara Tassoni. And I'd appreciate. Hey, settle down. He's My a jerk. Home was just destroyed, and all he can do is gloat. Apologize, Javik. Today, I think you owe Liara an apology, Javik. Apologize for the truth? For not doing more. You're a Prothean. You were supposed to have all the answers. How could you not stop this from happening? He's just one we Prothean. You would. Long ago, we saw the potential in your people. Even then, it was obvious. The wisdom, the patience. You were the best hope for this cycle, so you were guided when necessary. Well, it didn't work. You're still alive, aren't you? Your world may have fallen, but as long as even one Asari is left standing, the fight isn't over. Just look at him. I guess that goes for Protheans, too. Despair is the enemy's greatest weapon. Do not let them wield it. Liara to Sony. Thank you. That was unexpected. Thank you. We still need her talents. If grief overcomes her, she will be lost to us. So did you actually mean what you said? Does it matter? Liara's been a good friend to me. It matters. Then I will tell you what you want to hear. I meant what I said. Carry on. But still. Have you found some story on Thessia yet? Blig. No. I'm trying to word it right. What happens if you word it wrong? If I'm lucky, the Citadel Stock Exchange drops 2,000 extra points. And if you're unlucky? I don't know. I've never really been unlucky. Commander. Still find it hilarious that you're in Zaid's trash compactor room. Where did the trash compactor go? She went straight to her cabin. She's not answering her calm. How bad? I've never seen Liara like this. Not even after Noveria. Damn. Can you talk to her? You've known her as long as any of us. And with Palavan. I'm just another damn reminder of how many people are dying. You should talk to her. I'll go talk to Liara. You're a good friend.
because this is very bad. Come to think of it, I don't think I went and talked to her after her mother died. I'm a bad friend. I've studied Protheans my entire life. If I'd been shown the beacon on Fessia earlier... You would have needed Shepard's cipher to comprehend it. I still could have learned from it. Instead, my mother hid the galaxy's most important archaeological find from me. It must have been such a joke to her when I became a Prothean researcher. The penalties for withholding Prothean technology are among the harshest in Council space. Your mother's motives may have been simply to shield you. Perhaps. Thank you, Edie. I hadn't considered that. How did this happen, Shepard? Cerberus. My entire civilization. The Asari's history. The Protheans made it a lie all along. Is it really a and lie? I abandoned my people to hunt for the catalyst. Liara, you had nothing to do with the attack on Thessia. Nothing to do with it? I told those people on Thessia we'd save them. How many Asari died because I demanded their help? No. Shepard, that isn't true. You've been warning your people for four years, Liara. There's not a damn thing you should feel guilty about. If we move fast enough, they'll have a chance to survive this, to start again. We lost Thessia, but we haven't lost the Asari yet. Helping the refugees. That's something I can do. It's something I owe them. I knew you'd think of something. I still need some time, Shepard. But thank you. No problem. It's what a friend does. There is new information on the private messages terminal. Thank you. Possible book titles from Glyph. Flag this is a list of possible book titles. When this is all over, I'd like to publish what we've learned from the po about the Protheans. Hmm. Email from Sergeant to... Who, Sergeant? Next time you want to warn me about the Geth are our friends and that might we're... Uh, and that maybe we're not supposed to shoot the big robots? I almost pissed myself when these primes started dropping out of the sky and mopping up the Reapers. We fired a few rounds at them until we realized they weren't firing back. Then this one comes over and said that they're allied assistants and asks for our status. I'm not complaining, they say my crew, but I'm never living down having to apologize to a Geth for shooting one of all of its damn lights off. Hilarious. But higgledy piggledy, everything is hell. Hopefully, she's doing better now. Thanks for talking to her. Neither of us knew what to say. There's not much we can say, but being there helps. They added the name Thane Cryos. Morn Solus. They actually added names. Huh. I'd never noticed until I came up here and then Thane stuck out to me. That's a nice touch. I'll go talk to Joker. Then we'll probably do the N7 assignment where Cerberus is attacking and we'll save everything for next time. <laughs> Alright, here's another one. Uh, dates back to the Rachni Wars. So, a Krogan and a Thalarian have landed on a Rachni world for a top secret mission. That is unlikely. Thalarians rarely took part in raids on Rachni occupied worlds directly. <sighs> Missing the point. So, the two guys are climbing up a hill going through <laughs> this nasty green fog. And as they get near the top, they come out of the fog, and the Thalarian sees thousands of Rachni. He looks over at the Krogan and says, Oh, well, that makes me nervous. Krogan says, you think that's scary? When this is over, I have to go back down through that fog by myself. Ah. The implication being that the Solarian soldier would be dead. Yes. Thank you for killing the 2,000-year-old joke. That joke plays to racial stereotypes on both sides. The Krogan appears brutish and insensitive, while the Solarian appears weak. <laughs> stereotypes such as exemplified here led to the development and use of the genophage. Lol. Well, well, yeah. It's also one of the only jokes you'll hear both Salarians and Krogan telling. Comedy isn't really about being nice. Sometimes it's a way to air out the ugly things people think. So Thessia, huh? I guess the Asari are wishing they had fewer dancers and more commandos right about now. Too soon? 
people died. In case you hadn't noticed, we just lost a few million people. This isn't the time. You see this? Tip tree. Little colony out in the ass end of nowhere. My dad lives there. So does my sister. Reapers rolled in about two weeks ago. So you can assume that I'm generally aware there's a war on Commander. So why the jokes? Coping. Because Edie says that according to your armor's metabolic scans, you're under more stress now than during the Skillian Blitz. Like more than Elysium, where it was pretty much you versus 10,000 Batarians trying to kill you. And the last time I had a briefing with Anderson, he told me to take care of you. The guy leading the resistance on Earth is worried about you. And I'm supposed to help. I'm okay. I appreciate the thought, Joe. But I'm fine. The hell you are. You're like half robot at this point. No offense, Edie. <laughs> and it's my fault. When the Collectors blew up the first Normandy, you died because I wouldn't leave. Because you had to come back for me. Couldn't leave the best pilot in the fleet behind, could I? Yeah, well, I guess that would have looked bad on your report. Come on. We've got work to do. Shepard, I have a question about human behavior. Go ahead. This isn't the best time, Edie. Perhaps humor? A penguin is driving through the Arizona desert. I'm not in the mood. A lively rendition of La Marseillaise? No. Very well. I will maintain a respectful silence until you indicate otherwise. I mean, I activated the conversation. Why am I being the jerk? It's like, Edie, I want to talk. Okay, how about this? No! I'll quickly check my cabin. And then we'll head off to that in seven. Hello, boo. Squeak indeed. Why do I have to be the asshole? I, did pr I wonder where Edie got the information about my stress levels during the Skillian Blitz. Nice that that's still being referenced, though. Hourglass Nebula. That's new. Kepler Verge. Nubian Expanse. We'll check out the Hourglass Nebula. We'll head to the... Diddly D, just do the N7 assignment. And then we'll probably end so that we can. I found something. Make a nice end. Because I don't want to go super duper long, but I the N7s typically aren't terribly long. Oh yeah, because that's totally what we need. And then... After I scan these two places and do the N7 assignment, where Cerberus is attacking... We will then go... And end. Because we are, I don't want to go too long, and that saves like a decent thing where we can then maybe do the mission. Signal confirmed. Like the uh, the thing where Kyling's ship went. Next time. But I also need to decide if I want to do the DLCs before or after that. Shadow Broker Technology. I'll save that in case it's like a super jam-packed one for a return trip. It could be 750. 
doubtful that it is, but it could always be 750 fuel. I found something. Scan. Shadow Broker support team. All the way out here. Booyah. Grabbed it just in time. Faster than light jump successful. We'll come over here, grab the fuel, then we'll make a jump to the other place. The last one. No. Ah. Hate when it does weird things like that. Oh, you're pressed down. So you have to commit. Pickledy, pickledy. I feel like they expected me to go to Ploitari, then the other one. Once again, save. But yeah, I just, I, I'm definitely getting the feeling that Signal confirmed. Commander Shepard is going to die at the end of this game. My choices be damned. Like, it's one thing for Shepard to be able to die if you severely me uh, mess up the... Bibbidi-bop, the... Suicide mission in Mass Effect 2. It'll be very hurtful if I die with no way to stop anything. But, like, all the death flags are there. All the people, like, we're gonna name our children after you. And my joke about how there's gonna be so many shepherds flying around. Kepler Verge. Nubian Expanse first. Scan there. Then we'll go to Kepler Verge. Scan and do mission. We need more Daka. Who got to name this? I found something. Why can't I be free of the Reapers? Although it will be interesting to see research data from Pragya. Pragya. Where was Pragya again in all this? Pragya, Pragya. Pragya? I know we've, that was important to something before. Like it was a mission planet or something. Alright, at least now we know where it is. successful. I'm going to save just in case. It would be hilarious if one of these, like, super small Signal confirmed. ones had like a billion fuel things. Just like a bunch of people died coming to this system. Isn't that hilarious? Ha ha ha. And after we told those two guys off for scavenging. See ya, suckers. We Reapers eluded. I found something. Gib. That's n hopefully it isn't just credits, because I don't really need credits. What will this be? Alliance Frigate Truffligar Law. Fifty units of fuel. Hilarious. You're a jokester. Jolly jokester. Oh yeah, I forgot we're being hunted in here. 
And there's a lot of them coming. Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. I'm just gonna keep entering until I. Uh, yep, there we go. Reapers eluded. See us, there is. Now to Kepler Verge. We'll hold off on Horizon, Sanctuary Dilly Let's go. One last mission, and then I'll need to decide if I want to hold off and do like the DLCs next time with Doctor with the Citadel, and then excuse me, with the Citadel, and then everything. Gain chance to knock down and electrocuted additional nearby targets. Sure. Increased damage. Damage. So yeah, I'll either do the DLCs next time, or Sanctuary then DLCs. I might as well just do the DLCs. Great, it's that in there. We'll be there soon. Yes. Yes, Commander. It's not ideal, but she's the only one with any traction on this. The information It's just like that asteroid thing again. Somebody hiding monsters doing bad things. I'll take care of it, Admiral. See that you do. How the hell did Bollock become a good guy and the elusive man become an indoctrinated asshole? Hey, this is a nice planet. Man, I just had an idea. I'm gonna pause the game and extrapolate it. That loading, or like not loading, but like that drop-off animation really made me think, wow, I would kind of enjoy a Mass Effect game that was kind of open world and you like drop down on a bunch of different planets and the planets are kind of open world. I think that's what Andromeda is like, so we'll have to wait and see. I might just have to grab uh, Mass Effect Andromeda the next time it's, uh, the next time that it's uh, on sale. I keep forgetting that I have multiple ammo thingies. So yeah, I think I might be one of the minority people that enjoy Mass Effect Andromeda. So long as the fucking glitches are fixed. I don't trust, like, the latest Bioware shenanigans, so... More than likely I'll get the... The fan patch, because there has to be a fan patch. Fuck you. Where are you shooting me from? Yeah, fuck you. But yeah, if uh, Mass Effect Andromeda is like that, like, open world and you can just, like, go to various planets and do things, would be super cool. Still wish that I could, uh play like the other races play a quarian a turian but no it always has to be fucking human great I also need to look around for any pickupables because this is the type of mission that has a pickupable I just know it I can smell it Thessia I could then again, I thought the monastery didn't have any pick and the fact shows me it had to have been. That's the only, like, Nimbus diddly D that could have had the thing.
fair. Honestly, kind of excited to give Mass Effect Andromeda a try. Granted, it's also like the overall gameplay and uh, the overall gameplay and uh, oh hey, Cerberus encryption algorithms of some sort. Yay! But yeah, like um, overall gameplay and writing. Because if they bungle the writing too, that will really put a damper on the gameplay. Miss Sato, come in. Miss Sato, are you there? She must be afraid they'll find her if she responds. We need the final coordinates. Grace, listen to me. Can't talk. They're right outside. We need you. I know you're scared. This is more than you signed up for, but I won't let you down. I promise. Do it. Do it. Hello, Phantom. I'll beat you up. See, Kai Ling? That's you. That's what you're gonna be. Thank you, Omni Tool. Commander, they've almost got the doors open. Help! Got her covered, Commander. Area cleared. Picking up Miss Sato, then heading back to the rendezvous point. Good job, Lieutenant. Huzzah! Our communication station is secure. Operations in this theater are safe again. No small task to keep it that way. How is Miss Sato doing? She has to be transferred to a nearby Alliance station. She wants to help however she can. Good. We need all the help we can get. Hack it out. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, maxed out. Hell yeah. I was kind of close, 100 off. 740 seems to be max. But with that done, now that we got the Cerberus codes that are pick up, go to the Citadel thing, we're gonna go to the Citadel. Commander. We're gonna go to the Citadel, drop these off. And then that would also put me in prime position to do DLCs the next time that I play Mass Effect 3. Which I'll probably do. Since I have, like, Max, Reputation, Paragon, I don't think there's anything to, like, hold me back. So yeah, I'll probably do the DLCs and then go do the thing, because it's entirely possible that it could be You're a clear diddly to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Take me to the embassies, I guess. I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. And then I'll look about for anybody having anything to say. Officer Delk. Are you Delk? Nope. You're just a Turian without a gun. I have excellent news. Your daughter's paperwork has been processed. For the second time! Here you go. You're Intel, right? I found these encryption codes on a Cerberus engineer. I thought they might be helpful. Cerberus ciphers? That's exactly what we've been looking for. Thank you, Commander. Hell yeah. Memorial, just Jacob, Liara, James, Aid. And that's it. Alrighty then. I think I'll save by the transport, and the next time we'll do the Leviathan stuff. I would do it now, but I don't want to 
stretch my time out, and if this DLC, Leviathan, is anything like Omega, and that one mission was just, oh yeah, we're gonna get you set up, then uh, I fear. Yep, next time, we'll go to Dr. Bryson's. Ah, I saved anyway. I saved, so it doesn't matter. We'll quickly see where everyone is. Nobody is in my fish tank. Specialist trainer, Liara, Garrus, Engineer Adams. Engineer Adams is in crew deck. Hmm. I guess I'll go see if Tally has anything to say. She probably won't. And then we will end things. So I can do the DLCs next time. Okay, toughest mission. Horizon. No fair, I hadn't joined up with you yet. Lol. Find the Dead Reaper then. Really? The husks just ran up to us. Have you ever noticed that I carry a sniper rifle? You're the one who likes things at your range. And you prefer to keep everything at a distance. From husks? Absolutely. <laughs> Creepiest thing we fought. The Thorian. Your turn. I'm going with the Rachni. The Queen? But we didn't fight her either time. No, the little ones. Yeah. They look like spiders and they scuttle right toward you. I thought you liked it when things got up close and personal. Not when it's spiders. See, this is why Tally's the best. Hey. I like that there's little conversations, even just like over the comms. That's neat. I'm just coming up here so we can end things because I'm just going to reload my save. But at the same time, that conversation wouldn't have existed. We're saving. We have to save that conversation. But yes, having lots of fun with Mass Effect 3 and very interested in Mass Effect Andromeda. I'll probably take a Mass Effect break before I play that. But who knows? Time will tell. But yes, Mass Effect 3 is going swimmingly. I've maxed out my help bar, so I, I bought everybody the help I could. And still a lot of my... Uh, hilariously, only people from Mass Effect 2. Only people from Mass Effect 2 are in danger. Me, 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 me. At the same time, maybe the... Hey, go where Kai Ling was... Thing was... Is it timed? Who knows? It could be timed. I fear. Hmm. Considering that they have DLCs, like, there has to be, like, some kind of, uh, super duper warning. Hey, this is the. Uh, who knows? I'll decide the next time I stream. But yes, can't wait. And, uh, very interested in Andromeda. I'll dock it that in somewhere. Who knows? Mm hmm. But yes, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you want more from me, I have two YouTube channels, Neon Icy Wings and Neon Icy Games. The former for edited content, and the latter where all of these streams eventually end up as, like, archives. It's just like a nice little thing to do. And if you want even more from me, I also, well, I actually skipped a bit. If you're one of those people watching one of those archives on Neon Icy Games, you can watch me play these games live at twitch.tv slash Neon Icy Wings. And then, if you want even, even, even more from me, I also try to draw some and upload the results to Twitter, Tumblr, DeviantArt, and Newgrounds. All of them at Neon Icy Wings, except for Tumblr, which is Icy Wings Art Corner. But yes, but yes, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye, bye. Thank you.